the five biggest biotech trends. Steve Jobs once said that the biggest innovations in the 21st century would be at the intersection of biology and technology. We now have seen huge advances in genetic engineering, in genome sequencing and DNA modification. So let's look at some of the key trends I'm seeing in this space. We'll see more personalized medicine. We'll move away from this one size fits all healthcare, where modern genomics means it is possible to tailor the formulation of medicines for individuals depending on the makeup of their DNA. The sequencing of the first human genome cost something like $3 billion back in 2003. Nowadays, it can be done for around $500. Understanding the role of DNA plays in our health and our body's ability to fight disease makes it simpler to predict segments of the population where illness is likely to occur, make better diagnosis and also create targeted treatments that are dependent on individuals' genetic factors. Agricultural biotech. In farming, biotechnology is used to develop new crops that provide better yield and are more resistant to pets and diseases. This has the potential to be hugely valuable in a world facing a global food crisis where millions of people are at the risk of starvation. It means food can be grown that is richer in nutrients and lower in toxins that can be damaging to our health and our environment. We can also create completely new types of crops, such as caffeine-free coffee beans, which removes the need for an expensive polluting and waste-creating decaffeination process. Faster pharmaceutical testing and approval of medicines. Following the emergency development and approval of COVID-19 vaccines, huge efforts have been made to speed up this process of testing and approving new drugs. Much of this is reliant on research and data coming from the field of biotechnology. Traditionally, new drugs have taken up to 10 years to make it through a lengthy process of approval and certification. Biotech data is being used to speed up this process by allowing simulations of interactions between medicine and the human body, rather than having to rely on costly and time-consuming human trials for every stage of the process. Environmental biotechnology. In addition to more efficient crop production with less energy use and economical damage caused by pesticides, there are a number of other ways in which biotechnology is being harnessed in order to improve sustainability and reduce the environmental impact. This includes the creation of biological organisms specifically designed to break down plastics, enabling them to be uh, more efficiently recycled. This year, French company Carbois opened its first plant dedicated to breaking down PET plastic, which is commonly used in plastic bottles using genetically modified enzymes. Another hugely important field where we can expect to see ongoing innovation is in biofuels. New processes involving creating clean energy from agricultural and industrial waste and even algae are appearing thanks to advances in biotechnology. Artificial meat. Meat eating is having a big impact on the planet and a great deal of research is taking place to reduce this. This had, has led to the development of artificial and lab-grown meat, which involves creating and cultivating tissue artificially from muscle and fat cells that has the potential to hugely reduce the amount of energy, land and water used by the livestock industry, as well as reducing the methane emission, which are recognized as a leading cause for climate change. So watch this innovative space. To stay up to date, subscribe to my channel or check out my books Business Trends in Practice and Tech Trends in Practice.